Always wonderful to be part of something which is revolutionary and it gives me such immense pleasure that I'm part of the Star Sports Press Room. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Suren Sundaram and what an initial first two weeks we have had to the Tata IPL. Some enthralling action on the field, but off the field, it's been a homecoming of sorts. Well, the Star Sports Press Room, we invite members of the print, television and digital media, our friends who get to ask questions to our incredible star cast. So this wall on my right, on the count of three, one, two, three. Psst. There you go, those are the members of the media who get to ask questions to our incredible star cast. Now, I already met some of them last time around and there was one request. There was one request that there's one member of our incredible star cast who wants to ask questions. So, without wasting any without wasting any further time, let me bring on the one, the only, the Sardar of commentary. Please give it up for the Navjot Singh Sidhu! <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Aji, what's Guru? Not the first time that we're meeting, but every time I see you, there's a smile on your face. Aji, last time when we talked about our friends of media, they wanted to come back to Navjot Singh Siddhu, come back to the commentary, talk to them. There are many questions, but I have to first ask you this. They say, right, journalists, the first question is, how do you feel? Look, brother, I'm on cloud nine. This is the place where I'm on cloud nine. ये वो जगह है जहां टाइम सीजेस टू एग्जिस्ट कुछ चीजें ऐसी होती हैं जो जिसके बारे में आप पैशनेट हो आई बीन वेरी फॉर्चुनेट कि मेरा जो प्रोफेशन है right. मेरी जो हॉबी है वो मेरा प्रोफेशन बन चुका है सी मेरी जो पहचान है वो क्रिकेट से है मेरी जड़ जो है वो क्रिकेट से है तो नाम ही खोदोगे तो किधर जाओगे और पहचान खोदोगे लल्ला तो बिखर जाओगे <laughs> तो मैं उस पहचान के साथ जुड़ के अपने आप को खो देता हूं I go into a meditative state. When I pick up the mic, no, I ऐसे mic उठाता हूँ मुझे पता ही नहीं लगता है कि कब रात हो गई, कब खत्म हो गया। मैं कहता हूँ हैं, खत्म हो गया। कई बार आधे घंटे का session खत्म हो जाता है। That is a good sign. Right. And you see, when you're keeping busy and time flies, that means you're enjoying it. कोई भी undertaking, जब एक joy बन जाए, cup of joy बन जाए, वो successful है। और कोई भी चीज अगर बोझ बन जाए, तो और भी घोड़ा हो, उसको भी बोझ बोझ ढोने लगा दो ना वो भी गिर जाए। That's it। पर ये सारी जो चीजें आप बोलते हैं, जी, कभी-कभी लोगों ने ये भी सोचा है कि कोई किताब है जिसमें मैं मैं यहीं रुकता हूँ। भैया किताब मैं तुम्हें देता हूँ, तुम नीचे रख लो, बोल के दिखाओ। on that note, वो तुम्हारे दिमाग में कैसे आएगी मुझे समझ नहीं आएगी। On that note, बहुत सारे सवाल। Let's get started, ladies and gentlemen. First question coming from our old friend, जिनसे पिछली बार भी मुलाकात हुई थी, from INS, Nayarika Raina, पूछिए अपना सवाल। My question to Sidhu sir is regarding tomorrow's clash between the Royal Challengers Bangalore and the Lucknow Super Giants. Like, does he feel concerned over the lack of variety? in the Royal Challengers Bengaluru bowling lineup, especially after they failed to stop Narayan, Salt and other KKR batters from going big at the Chinnasamy Stadium last week. Nyarika, thank you so much for that question. And Paji, this is the Maha Match of the Week for us this week. Look, the biggest thing is that for any team to win, that no individual, no big player doesn't win. These five fingers are very important. कोई लंबी है, कोई छोटी है, कोई टेढ़ी है, कोई मोटी है। लेकिन जब इकट्ठा हो जाती है ना, तो अपने बोझ से सौ गुना भार उठा लेती है, right? कई बार घुंसा बनके बत्तीसी भी निकाल देती है, right? सर्दी है। So that is what it is. The team combination wins your match. और जब तक आप उस संतुलन को देखो, अगर आप tight rope walk कर रहे हो, तो आपके हाथ में वो डंडा कि हम लोग गोली के बारे में बात करते हैं, फैफ के बारे में बात करते हैं। Well, you got to settle the right horse. उनकी कमजोरी जो है, the chain is as strong as the weakest link. उनकी कमजोरी है, उनका spin department। गेंदबाज। उनकी उनकी spinners जो हैं, वो है ही नहीं। सच्ची बात बोलो, अब मुझे चिड़िया जो है, दो पंखों से उड़ेगी ना? It takes two to tango, right? Isn't it? Yep. अब जब आप एक पंख वाली चि� you can see me and you are like a kiwi bird. Your imagination resembles that of an ostrich. You are a bird, you can run but you can't fly. So therefore, they will have to replenish that area. Because if you play in India, you can see that without a spinner, without a quality spinner, they had Hasaranga first. And Hasaranga was pretty good. Then it was Chahal. 
दे लेट दम गो तो उससे क्या है एक वॉइड क्रिएट कर दिया है और उस वॉइड को दे हैव नॉट बीन एबल टू फिल दैट वॉइड दे प्रिडिक्टेबल लव लुक एट धोनी वेन धोनी कम्स नो बडी नोज इज प्लान करेक्ट भाले की नोक से एक आदमी मरता है विश के प्याले से सेना गिरा दो और गुरु गुप्त विचार अगर प्रकट हो जाए ना तो राष्ट्र तबाह हो जाते हैं वो गुप्त विचार प्रकट ही नहीं होता धोनी का हाँ। अब इनको देखो आप तो आपको पता है कि क्या होने सो प्रडिक्टेबल कि यार वो फास्ट चार फास्ट बोलो के उनके पास स्पिनर है ही नहीं हाँ। एक पंख की चिड़िया से आप उड़ान नहीं भर सकते ओके okay, निहारिका आई होप आपको अपना जवाब जो है मिल गया आई कैन क्लियरली सी दैट यू आर स्माइलिंग नेक्स्ट हम बढ़ते हैं अभिषेक निगम की तरफ फ्रॉम दैनिक जागरण अभिषेक पूछिए अपना सवाल सर जो टी ट्वेंटी वर्ल्ड कप होना है उसमें आईपीएल की क्या भूमिका रहने वाली है और आपको ऐसे कौन से यंगस्टर्स लग रहे हैं जो दावेदार हो सकते हैं देखिए ये बहुत बढ़िया सवाल है एक जमाना था दोस्त के इन सर्च ऑफ ग्रीनर पास्चर्स वी वुड गो टू इंग्लैंड हम लोग इंग्लैंड खेलते थे काउंटी खेलते थे और वो एक बेंच माना जाता था कि भाई यहां जो खेल के आया अजर यूज टू गो एवरीबडी यूज टू गो अवेयर राइट ससेक्स खेलता कोई मिडिल सेक्स खेलता नाउ दिस इज अ रिवर्सल ऑफ फॉर्चून टूडे द होल वर्ल्ड इज ग्रेविटेटिंग टूवर्ड्स दी आई पी एल राइट मनी मेक्स द मेयर गो एंड वी आर मेकिंग द मेयर गो वी आर मैनेजर्स इन चीफ ठीक है नी मनी इज लाइक अलादी इन लैम्प यू कैन डू एनीथिंग विद एंड इट्स नो गुड अंटिल इट स्प्रेड इट्स स्प्रेडिंग ऑल्सो ग्लोबलाइजेशन हमारे छोटे शहरों में वो जा रहा है तो अब उनके सवाल का मैं उत्तर देता हूं कि जब वर्ल्ड कप के पहले आप आईपीएल खेलते हैं और पूरी दुनिया की क्रीम आपके साथ खेल रही है इट्स लाइक द वर्ल्ड कप वर्ल्ड कप चार साल बाद आता है कुंभ का मेला बारह साल बाद ये हर साल आता है ठाए ठाए एंड यू आर सेलिब्रेटिंग क्रिकेट यू आर इंजॉइंग एंड सेलिब्रेटिंग क्रिकेट एंड एवरी बडी इन दिस कंट्री इज कनेक्टेड टू इट अब जब यहां पर पहले आप रांझी ट्रॉफी खेलते थे किसी को पता ही नहीं लगता था टैलेंट क्या कैसे खेल रहा है कौन किस तरह से खेल रहा है कुछ जाता ही नहीं था भाई 500 बंदे बैठे होते थे कई बार कई मैचों में ज्यादा भी जाते थे लेकिन आईपीएल में जैम पैक्ड इट्स अ वर्ल्ड प्लेटफॉर्म और यहां पे ओवरनाइट व्हेन यू स्कोर यू बिकम अ स्टार और तुम दावेदार हो जाते हो सीधा दावेदार हो जाते हो दुनिया में इंस्टेंट कॉफी कोई नहीं है आपने बड़ी मेहनत की है लेकिन यह वाकई लिफ्ट है दे नो लिफ्ट इन लाइफ इट्स ऑलवेज अ ग्रीज पोल बट दिस इज योर लिफ्ट अगर कोई बच्चा यहां पर आके परफॉर्म करता है तो वो दस सीढ़ियां पहले दिन ही चढ़ता है तो बहुत से ऐसे दावेदार हैं बहुत से ऐसे दावेदार हैं मैं सिलेक्शन वाले उसमें एनक्रोच नहीं करूंगा लेकिन जो यहां परफॉर्म करेगा वो एक तरह से तूती बजाएगा कि भाई मेरी तरफ देखो मैं भी हूं क्या वो भूख ज्यादा दिखेगी क्योंकि आईपीएल अप्रैल खत्म होगा और वही डेड है अपनी टीम भेजने के लिए टू दी आईसी क्या वर्ल्ड कप में देखिए आप भूख की बात करते हो ना आप दस साल पहले देखिए इंडियन प्लेयर्स का स्तर क्या था जैसे हम जाते थे ना दिल्ली में तो कपल दे अच्छा फलाना हो डर जाता था बंदा सहम जाता था ऐसा लगता था वी डू नॉट बिलोंग टू दैट एरिया और दैट अरीना टुडे यू लुक एट दीज यंगस्टर्स नाउ द इंडियन प्लेयर्स द सेवन इंडियन प्लेयर्स आर डोमिनेटिंग द फॉरनर्स आल्सो देयर आर स्टेजेस वेयर यू हैव जस्ट थ्री फॉरेन प्लेयर्स एंड एट इंडियन प्लेयर्स ब्रो नाउ दैट इज एवोल्यूशन कॉल दैट इज रबिंग शोल्डर्स विद द बेस्ट इन द वर्ल्ड एंड इवॉल्विंग एंड ग्रोइंग इंडियन क्रिकेट जो है इट इज ब्लॉसमिंग लाइक अ डेजी बिकॉज ऑफ दी कंपनी देखो शेयर की मान में आप जाओगे तो हाथी के माथे की मुक्ता मणि मिलेगी लेकिन अगर आप गीदड़ की मान में जाओगे तो बछड़े की पूंछ मिलेगी संगत का ही असर है ना दोस्त जब संगत ऐसी होगी तो आप तरक्की अवश्य करोगे वॉट आई लर्न प्लेइंग इन पटियाला स्मॉल टाउन वन आई केम इन टू द इंडियन टीम आई लर्न इट इन वन मंथ A conversation with a wise man is worth months of education. Yeah. The best of coaches, the cream of the world, and one of the f- one of few great minds. Ricky Ponting के साथ आप बैठोगे, he will share all those things with you. Right. So therefore, this is the evolution for those youngsters. And बहुत सारे दावेदार हैं. अगर मैं किसी एक को कह दूँगा तो वो फिर मतलब एक favourite हो जाएगी. फिर वो controversy बन जाएगी. हाँ, बिल्कुल. Love you, Pasi. <laughs> all right. Next question coming from Dhanik Bhaskar, and I think Kyur पूछने वाले हैं सवाल. हेलो पाजी के यू दिस साइड फ्रॉम दैनिक भास्कर मेरा क्वेश्चन है कि मुंबई इंडियंस पहले दो मैच हार गई है तो अब उस वापसी कैसे करेगी और साथ ही साथ हार्दिक पांड्या को मैनेजमेंट को क्या करना होगा हार्दिक पांड्या के लिए देखो तुमने बड़ा अच्छा सवाल पूछा और ये सवाल जो है ना ये पूरे हिंदुस्तान का सवाल है 
इसलिए मैं इस सवाल पे थोड़ा वक्त लगाऊंगा बड़ा अच्छा सवाल है देखिए पहली चीज तो कि दो मैच हार के आप वापस आ सकते हो मुझे आप भी याद है पहली कॉमेंट्री नाइनटी नाइन आई वेंट टू इंग्लैंड ऑस्ट्रेलिया हैड लॉस्ट ऑलमोस्ट एवरीथिंग एट द स्टार्ट ऑफ द टूर्नामेंट एंड देन आई सॉ स्टीवन वॉक कम अप एंड से ऑल वी गॉट टू डू इज विन फाइव इन अरो एंड दे वन फाइव इन अरो एंड आफ्टर दैट दे वन द वर्ल्ड कप सो दे बिन दे बिन स्लो स्टार्टर्स अग्रीड बट लुक एट the opportunity they are getting 71% is the record last year the matches that they won at home yeah not only strike while the iron is hot but make it hot by striking right so ye hai wo mauka safalta ka asli karan hai mool karan hai ki aap avsar ke liye taiyar rahe the magarmach pani mein hai bro jab magarmach pani mein hai na to koi use pachhad nahi sakta apne ghar mein अपनी बीट पे तो मुर्गा भी कुड़कुड़ करता है कॉक क्रोज ओवर डंगल ब्रो समझा नहीं yeah. अपनी अपनी गली में कुत्ता भी शेर होता है ये तो बब्बर शेर है ये सब बब्बर शेर है और जब अपने घर में खेलेंगे तो मुझे पता है कि दे विल एक्चुअली मल्टीप्लाई देर स्ट्रेंथ दी ओनली क्वेश्चन इज दैट आपको थोड़ा बहुत फाइन ट्यूनिंग करनी होगी कॉम्बिनेशन की ठीक है बोलिंग की अब आया सवाल सबसे बड़ा सर जो सबसे बड़ा सवाल है वो ये है कि हार्दिक पांड्या मुझे लगता है हार्दिक पांड्या का को कोई कसूर नहीं फैंस क्यों रिएक्ट कर रहे हैं दुनिया क्यों रिएक्ट कर रही है बिकॉज ये सबसे बड़ा उत्तर मैं दे रहा हूं और मैं बड़ा सोच समझ के सौ बार सोचता हूं फिर बोलता हूं लेकिन जब बोलता हूं तो ठोक के बोलता हूं वो ये जज्ब नहीं कर पा रहे कि भाई एक इंडिया का कैप्टन आपने अनाउंस कर दिया फेब्रवरी में यू अनाउंसड इंडिया कैप्टन फॉर द वर्ल्ड कप फॉर द वर्ल्ड कप एंड दैट इंडिया कैप्टन इज नॉट कैप्टन ऑफ इज ओन फ्रेंचाइजाइज Yeah. Now that is something that people have failed to fathom. Because, see, do anything you want. IPL is the pride of this country. Take pride out of man, and he's like an umbrella without the ribs. Okay, right? Yeah. Who, in the whole world, is your pride? Huh? His pride is the pride of man, and his pride is the satvik sugandit pushp, which is the pride of the gods and the gods. There, where the pride of man is the pride of 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 राइट ट्रू एंड बिकॉज यू वर एक्सपेक्टिंग सो मच हार्दिक ने दो एक टूर्नामेंट जिताया फिर उसके बाद फाइनल्स में ले गए यू वर एक्सपेक्टिंग सो मच नाउ द हैप्पीएस्ट इज अ मैन फ्रॉम होम नो वन एक्सपेक्ट बट वेन देर आर एक्सपेक्टेशन एंड यू कैन नॉट लिव अप टू दम देन देर इज बाउंड टू बी बैक क्लैश और मैं एक और बात बता दू एक और थोड़ा सा चानन डाल देता हूं मैं वो क्या है कि जब रोहित टी ट्वेंटी खेले पिछली आईपीएल उसके बाद वो सिर्फ आके जनवरी में खेले तो मुझे लगता है फ्रेंचाइजी को शायद ये लग रहा होगा कि भाई बिकॉज देव ऑप्टेड आउट ऑफ टी ट्वेंटी मैच दे नॉट प्लेइंग टू मेनी टी ट्वेंटी मैच विराट एंड रोहित वी नीड समैट कैन एक्चुअली पिक अप द कॉन्फ्लेट एंड मूव ऑन अ यंग फेलो बिकॉज इज अंग मैन डायनामिक कैप्टन लीडर अगर अगर ये अनाउंसमेंट पहले हुई होती अक्टूबर में तो आई एम श्योर द फ्रेंचाइजी वुड रियलाइज बॉस ये 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 पगड़ी का सवाल है भाई हिंदुस्तान का कप्तान फ्रेंचाइजी का कप्तान कैसे नहीं होगा आज तक नहीं हुआ right. ये आज तक नहीं हुआ, नहीं हुआ. तो It's ये किसी का कसूर नहीं है इट्स जस्ट द रॉन्ग टाइमिंग टाइमिंग कि वो टाइमिंग उन्होंने पहले फ्रेंचाइजी ने अनाउंस कर दिया और जब इंडियन क्रिकेट कंट्रोल बोर्ड ने फेबर hmm. में आकर उसे कप्तान अनाउंस किया तो फिर भाई थोड़ा सा मुश्किल हो दुविधा दुविधा है, दुविधा है, डिलेमा है, करेक्ट डिलेमा है। लेकिन आई थिंक ये हार्दिक पंड्या का जो टॉपिक है इस पर सिर्फ एक सवाल नहीं आ रहा है देर इज अनदर क्वेश्चन आई नॉट रॉन्ग अंकित श्रेष्ठ फ्रॉम द प्रेस ट्रस्ट ऑफ इंडिया आप भी अपना सवाल प्लीज सिद्धू भाजी से पूछे <coughs> Hi, uh, hi. Good afternoon, sir. Uh, sir, just uh, my question would be along the same lines. Um, sir, uh, uh, what should uh, Pandya do differently to, uh, you know, make his uh, captaincy more effective? And sir, uh, which teams do you think uh, are like the dark horse of this uh, tournament, or maybe perhaps even uh, a young captain like uh, Shubman Gill, who is novice, novice in terms of captaincy, um, can take his team to the third consecutive final? Look, there are many people who ask me, how about Shubman Gill? what about rutu raj right now i tell them can you judge a jewel by the casket no, can you no, all right can you judge a book by the cover no. 
आपने कवर देखा आपने किसी किताब का कवर देखा और कहा यार ये किताब बड़ी अच्छी हो सकता है नहीं हो सकता सो यू कैनॉट जज ए कैप्टन वन और टू गेम्स एंड मोर सो वेन ऋतुराज इज लिविंग इन द शेडो ऑफ धोनी देखो बरगद का पेड़ अपनी छाया देता तो जरूर है लेकिन जो यात्री है ना उसको छाया नहीं देता वो यात्री अपना अकेला ही चलता है छाया उसके साथ ही रहती है तो मुझे नहीं लगता है कि अभी इट इज टू अर्ली टू प्रोजेक्ट दे आर लोडेड विथ पोटेंशियल उत्तरदायित योग्य और योग्यता और शक्ति के साथ चलता है लेकिन आप ये नहीं कह सकते दो मैचों के बाद कि ये अच्छा है और ये बुरा है right. समझे नहीं right. पार्ट वन ऑफ द क्वेश्चन सेकेंड पार्ट क्या है भाई हार्दिक हार्दिक की वापसी मुंबई में पाजी मैं हार्दिक नीड टू डू या इन द सेंस जब से हम लोगों ने क्रिकेट देखना स्टार्ट किया है नो क्रिकेटर हैज मैनेज टू गेट द क्राउड सो पोलराइज एंड हार्दिक जो दो मैच खेल के आए हैं नाउ ही कम्स होम यहां पे कैसा आप उनको वेलकम मिले देखिए मैंने आपको उसका क्लियर कर दिया है कि किसी को ये सी नो बडी कैन डाइजेस्ट कि यार हमारा हीरो हमारा कैप्टन इंडिया का कैप्टन फ्रेंचाइजी का कैप्टन ही है वॉट रॉन्ग एज ही डन विदाउट कोर्ट से और वो वो सो दैट आंसर इज पार्ट ऑफ द क्वेश्चन दैट ही इज आस्ट राइट बट वॉट डज ही नीड टू डू राइट देर इज नथिंग दैट सक्सीड लाइक सक्सेस देखो अगर यही दो मैच जीते हो तो ना एक आवाज नहीं आनी थी एक आवाज नहीं आनी थी मुझे ये लगता है कि वो अपने कॉम्बिनेशन पर ध्यान दें ही हैज टू कंबाइन देखो जब आप दो सौ सतहत्तर रन देते हो तो वो चीखे मार के सारी दुनिया कह रही है भाई तुम्हारी बोलिंग ठीक नहीं 277 जो टूर्नामेंट में कभी नहीं हुआ आपके खिलाफ कैसे हो गया भाई आप अगर इतने ही पाटे खां थे तो 277 कैसे हो गए और दूसरा मैच वो दो रन से दो तीन रन से हारे तो डिफीटेड बट नॉट डिस्ग्रेस दे विल हैव टू एक्चुअली पैप अप देयर बोलिंग एंड इफ दे कैन एक्चुअली देव गॉट अ वेरी गुड बोलिंग ऑन पेपर दे लुक सॉलिड बट माइनर एडजस्टमेंट लाइक वॉट धोनी डस धोनी के लिए कौन वे गए एंड ही वॉज द लीडिंग रन गेटर सो ही बॉट इन रचिन रविंद्र रचिन रविंद्र सिमिलर इवन बेटर सी यू नॉट मिसिंग इम राइट सो दैट इज द काइंड ऑफ रिप्लेसमेंट दैट यू गॉट डू राइट एंड सम वे डाउन द लाइन यू मे यू मे से यार बीस का उन्नीस हो सकता है उन्नीस का लेकिन अगर आप बीस की जगह पर दस लाख खड़ा कर दोगे ही बी एक्सपोज वॉट इज हैपनिंग इज अब शमी की रिप्लेसमेंट नहीं है Hardik was playing with Shami, right? Shami was picking up wickets. Shami was taking wickets, and he had taken almost twenty-eight wickets. Right, highest wicket. Now, when you take twenty wickets, you get to Rashid Dugna. When someone has taken three wickets, the batsman is new, standing, and the spinner has come, then you say, "Brother, brother, don't play the game. Don't play the game." Okay. And if those two set batsmen come and you take Rashid to sixty for no loss, Rashid is not even half the bowler. Get my point. Correct, correct. So there are voids that you need to fill, and as far as I am concerned, the combination gets you going. It's like a jigsaw puzzle, brother. आप वो jigsaw fit करते हैं ना? अगर एक दो blocks बाहर रह जाएं, तो वो picture looks hazy. Right. So the moment the picture looks rosy, if you're winning, <laughs> the picture will look rosy. From But if you're losing, rosy. then it's a bed of thorns. फिर कांटा टन टन चुभेगा पैर में चुभा हुआ कांटा दिखाई नहीं देता लेकिन उसकी टीस हर पल पड़ती है ट्रू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज कमिंग फ्रॉम द हिंदू प्रसन्न वेंकटेशन भाजी ने ऑलरेडी एक आह कर दिया यानी कि ही इज अबाउट टू एंजॉय दिस क्वेश्चन प्रसन्न प्लीज आस्क यू क्वेश्चन हेलो सर दिस इज प्रसन्न फ्रॉम द हिंदू my question is about mayank yadav uh, how excited were you and uh, what were your thoughts watching him bowl and uh, uh, for to me he evoked uh, the fearsome west indies bowling of the 1970s and 80s bowling short <laughs> bowling short at 150 kph so uh, i i also thought that he should play test cricket so what are your thoughts on him wonderful wonderful look brother you got to unlock his potential right any talent is nothing if it is not controlled disciplined and harnessed i have seen shawn tate bowl at 155 160 but at times he was bowling at the other wicket teen <laughs> wicket hai na teen ye 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 practice pitch mein uska game dusri pitch mein dikh gaya to samjha nahi to that means you are frittering away your energy right second thing is coming close to the wicket right ab aise log inki originality itni takdi hai they need to be sent to the academy their their skills need to be honed more so the training schedule has to come fast bowler is nothing but fitness jitne bhi fast bowler aata hai so ian bishop at his quickest in the west indies now he's talked about the west indies Correct. at his quickest in the west indies then he had this back back, back problem yep he was never the same correct so 
कपिल पाजी की मुझे बात याद आती है कि पुत्र फास्ट बॉलर घोड़ा होता है फास्ट बॉलर को घोड़ा होना चाहिए एंड आई नेवर सॉ इम इट्स ओनली द लास्ट मैच दैट ही प्लेड दैट ही हैड अ टोन इंजरी नहीं हुई थी आई हैव नेवर सीन कपिल देव इंजर्ड राइट ना दैट इज द काइंड ऑफ स्ट्रेंथ दैट यू विल गेट फास्ट बोलिंग इज अ लॉट ऑफ हार्ड वर्क a lot of rehabilitation a lot and there is a special way of how you train now we talked about the west indian fast bowlers Which the difference was <laughs> the difference is fast bowlers hunt in pairs ha jab aap ek taraf se aapko run mil rahe hain ya ek taraf se aap block karke nikal rahe ho aur ek koi jhel raha hai to aap nikal doge na usko hai na bilkul sahi but when there are four five fast bowlers coming at you fir to teeron se bach rahe ho <laughs> वो यादव साहब के भाई जब मुंबई खेलने गए ना इज अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग स्टोरी तो मुंबई खेलने गए तो वो जब ग्राउंड में उतरे ना तो कह रहा है बाप रे बाप गावस कर आएगा बैंक सर कर आएगा मंजरे कर आएगा तेंडुलकर आएगा किस किस को आउट करेगा <laughs> तो यू नो मेंटली मेंटली यू आर डेड एंड दी दिस दिस मेंटल फोर्टीट्यूड डजेंट होल्ड जब आप हारते जाते हो आप <laughs> हारते जाते हो ये मेंटल डिसइंटीग्रेशन दो ऑस्ट्रेलियंस बॉट दिस वर्ल्ड वो क्या करते थे कप्तान को अटैक करते थे लारा आया तो लारा को अटैक किया आप कप्तान को गिरा दो सेना खुद ब खुद गिरेगी सी ना दिस इज वेयर आई फील आर्ट ऑफ वॉक हाँ दी फास्ट बोलर इन द वेस्ट इंडीज आर मिस्ड बिकॉज वो मेंटली आपको ग्राउंड में जाने से पहले गिरा देते थे तीन दिन मैच दो दिन गोल्फ <laughs> समझा ना तो ये तो ये भारतीय क्रिकेट में हो सकता है आई सी वंडरफुल फास्ट बोलर्स फ्यूचर्स इन ग्रेट हैंड्स कल खलील किया ना उसने yeah. तो ऐसे फास्ट बोलर्स को अगर आप डिसिप्लिन कर लो घोड़ा घोड़ा लगाम दोगे ना तो डेस्टिनेशन पे पहुंचाओगे right. लेकिन अगर वो लगाम नहीं होगी तो वो आपको गिराएगा करेक्ट अगला सवाल गुरु ओके दिया कक्कर जी फ्रॉम इंडिया टुडे आप अपने सवाल के साथ तैयार हैं यस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल हाय सिद्धु सर एंड कांग्रेचुलेशंस ऑन डूइंग व्हाट यू डू द बेस्ट यस एंड यू नो माय क्वेश्चन टू यू इज इन योर आइकॉनिक स्टाइल यू हैव सेड दैट हाउ एक असली हीरे की कदर एक जोहरी को होती है इन द कॉन्टेक्स्ट ऑफ यू नो एमएस धोनी पुशिंग अ यंगस्टर लाइक समीर रिजवी अप द ऑर्डर But you know, then we saw M. S. Dhoni in his vintage style, truly turning back the clock. So should he still be batting down the order, or should he take us, the fans, by surprise and move himself up the order? Or do you think that you know pushing a youngster uh, makes more sense? <laughs> दिया आपने पूछा है मिलियन डॉलर सवाल सवाल बड़ा जबरदस्त जी क्या सवाल बड़ा पहली बात तो उन्होंने मेरा हौसला बढ़ाया एनकरेजमेंट इज लाइक प्रीमियम गैसोलीन इट हेल्प्स यू टेक द नॉक आउट ऑफ लाइफ थैंक यू वेरी मच दूसरा सवाल बड़ा अहम है देखो द बिगर चैलेंज इज नॉट बैटिंग एट थ्री और फोर द बिगर चैलेंज इज वेन यू बैट फॉर द लास्ट सिक्स ओवर्स लास्ट सेवन ओवर्स दैट इज अ टाइम वेन यू आर रियली टेस्टेड वाई बिकॉज यू आर गोइंग टू बी स्कोरिंग एट वन बॉल थ्री रन वन बॉल टू एंड हाफ ये स्किल बहुत कम लोगों में है मैं तुम्हें बता रहा हूं इट्स नॉट ईजी टू बी अ फिनिशर यू आर नॉट गेटिंग एक्ट बट इट्स द क्वालिटी ऑफ दो रन विच एक्चुअली हेल्प टीम विन और लूज चंदन का एक टुकड़ा बबूल के चंगल से कहीं बेहतर होता है अ ड्रॉप ऑफ हनी कैच इज मोर फ्लाइज देन गैलन ऑफ विनेगर इज इट सो दे फॉर फिटिंग पीपल इन द राइटफुल प्लेस इज वॉट इज मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट धोनी इज एन एसेट When he bats and finishes with Jadeja, एक और एक ग्यारह ग्यारह हो रहे हैं ना सो दे आर मल्टीप्लाइंग देर स्ट्रेंथ सो वाई वुड एंड देन वेन यू टॉक ऑफ रिजवी देखो धोनी ने को कुछ प्रूव करना नहीं टू बिल्ड देखो लीडर की सबसे तगड़ी ताकत पता क्या होती है ही बिल्ड फ्यूचर लीडर्स और वो ही विल ही विल एक्चुअली बिल्ड अनलॉक पोटेंशियल फॉर यंगस्टर्स तो जब आप रिजवी को भेजते हैं आई शॉट ड्राविड in the first four one day internationals that he played in sharja mu aise latka hua tha teen run banaye the mere ko lagta hai char innings mein aise latka hua tha aise lag so there were people who would come to him no don't worry you have it in you yeah. don't worry and look where dravid boy did he have it in him ha ha to wo baad mein hame updesh deta tha aur wo updesh tha karke lagte the right so therefore i feel talent is nothing without opportunity any talent whether it was kapil sharma performing in amritsar right in a in a natshala right or or lalli or it is a youngster performing in the ipl you have to give him opportunity so ek panth do kaaj ek to opportunity yeah aur ek 
आप उस चैलेंज को एक्सेप्ट कर रहे हो जो रेयर इट इज स्किल एंड नॉट स्ट्रेंथ दैट गवर्न योर शिप ओ रेयर कि आप अंदर से ही सेट होके आओ और पहली बॉल छे उसने कल दिया ना कल पहली बॉल चौका करेक्ट ठीक है नॉट द रिजुट इन डू इट यू गॉट टू गिव इन द कॉन्फिडेंस देखो वही आदमी दूसरी टीम में उतना तगड़ा नहीं है लेकिन जब धोनी के पास आता है तो उसमें विश्वास जग जाता है क्यों बिकॉज गुड लीडर इज वन दो वॉक बिहाइंड हिम हैव फेथ विश्वास जगा देता है पीछे चलने वालों में वही लीडर है आज तक आज तक स्पोर्ट्स तक से इनफैक्ट है नितिन श्रीवास्तव पाजी से आप अपना सवाल पूछे नितिन पाजी चूंकि अभी आईपीएल है और सेलेक्टर्स जो है वो नजरें रखे हुए हैं हमारे सारे प्लेयर्स के ऊपर में वर्ल्ड कप की टीम भी चुन ली है उन्हें लेकिन कुछ खिलाड़ी ऐसे हैं जैसे कि के एल राहुल हो गया अभी वो इंजरी से वापस आए हैं सूर्य अभी तक अपनी टीम में नहीं जुड़ पाया है मोहम्मद शमी बाहर बैठे हुए इंजरी की वजह से आपको लगता है कि वर्ल्ड कप की टीम बनाने के लिए सिलेक्टर्स को बड़ी माथा पच्ची करने की जरूरत पड़ेगी और ऑल्सो कुछ हम यहाँ से टैलेंट को जरूर लेंगे तो एक वो बड़ा सिरदर्द होने वाला है और कौन कौन आपको लगता है प्लेयर्स की वर्ल्ड कप के अंदर में आईपीएल से आ जाएंगे कुछ नाम तो सेट है ऑलरेडी नहीं आपने बड़ा अच्छा सवाल किया देखिए सबसे बेहतर चीज है कि जो भी आप ले वो फिट प्लेयर ले क्योंकि अगर यू डोंट चेंज हॉर्सेस मिड स्ट्रीम अगर किसी आदमी की फिटनेस शक के घेरे में है इज गॉट नो राइट टू प्ले स्पेशली लेटिंग डाउन हिज कंट्री बिकॉज ही इज प्लेइंग एट सेवेंटी बट देर आर टाइम्स वेन अ गावस्कर हैज अगल सो ही एट सेवेंटी परसेंट is much better than someone else at 100%. Right. Those are things that the selectors must. But at the moment the Indian selectors have the problem of plenty. When I say problem of plenty it's a sweet predicament. Right. And when you have a sweet predicament all you want to know is ke jo jaise Pant hai jaise KL Rahul hai agar wo fit hai to wo deserve karte hain kyunki aapko ek spare keeper bhi chahiye. Lekin agar wo fit nahi hai so then he has to actually go back and get fit before he's taken into the indian side you cannot compromise the expectations of 150 crores right 1.5 billion expecting the world cup aur wahan pe aap injure ho jate ho aur ek injury wale player ko leke chale jate ho right then then half a measure is it rani 14 leke ja rahe ho ha to tum chaap jab 14 leke ja rahe ho you make sure that they are fit एब्सोल्यूटली right. चाहे वो डॉक्टर का टेस्ट हो <laughs> चाहे वो आईपीएल का टेस्ट हो राइट right. ये नहीं है देखो सिंपति इज फॉर द वीक एंड द वीक गो टू द कुकिंग पॉट देर शुड बी नो सिंपति एम्पथी यस एम्पथी यस अ ग्रेट प्लेयर हैज टू बी गिवन द ऑपरचुनिटी और मैंने ये मैं उनको बता रहा हूं कि मोहिंद्र अमरनाथ साहब का नाम आप सबने सुना हुआ बिल्कुल यू नो दोर दैट ही लेफ्ट फॉर वेस्ट इंडीज इन एटी सेवन एंड पाकिस्तान दो टू टूअर where he was hailed as the greatest player of fast bowling by Imran Khan and Clive Lloyd both of them ek ke paas panch fast bowler the dusre ka dusre ke paas aapko pata hi hai kitne fast bowler the correct eent uthao fast bowler eent ke upar fast bowler eent ke niche fast bowler right to jab mohinder amarnath injured hue to i saw sunil gavaskar and the chairman of selection committee mr bode saab the so we were playing a ranji trophy game to jimmy pa i और ये दोनों भी आके बैठ गए हुए तो पता लगा यार चेयरमैन ऑफ सिलेक्शन कमेटी आए हुए हैं और उनके साथ सुनील गावस्कर कैप्टन ऑफ द इंडियन टीम तो मोहिंद्र अमरनाथ साहब पैड वैड पहने कमिंग अप बैक आफ्टर अ लॉन्ग टाइम सिक्स मंथ्स एंड ही जस्ट स्टेप्ड आउट ऐसे करके एंड ओवर कवर्स ही जस्ट हिट वन बाउंड्री बोथ ऑफ दम गॉट अप एंड लेफ्ट रस्ते में जब जा रहे थे मैंने सनी भाई को यूं किया सो इज टॉकिंग टू चंदू बोर्ड माई मैन इज रेडी <laughs> जिस आदमी ने ग्राउंड पे 20 बीस सौ बनाए हुए हैं गॉट नथिंग टू प्रूव ओनली फिटनेस टू प्रूव दैट्स व्हाई आई फील पंथ और समवन लाइक हिम इज जस्ट द फिटनेस एंड यू शुड बी हैप्पी कि इतनी देर बाद वो बंदा आके खेल रहा है असंभव को संभव किया है yeah. इसीलिए मैं कहता हूं असंभव शब्द इंपॉसिबल इज अ वर्ल्ड only in the dictionary of the fools <laughs> right <laughs> all right one final question for sidupa which is coming in from amit times of india oh. amit ji sawal puche uh, hi ramjot sir good evening to you good evening sir uh, uh, ramjot sir my question is that ki uh, csk will be without ms dhoni next season so ipl aur fans kitna affect honge legendary ms dhoni ke absence se kaisa rahega ipl without ms dhoni and uh, and the the second part of the question is that that did 
CSK take the right decision to make Rituraj Gaikwad the captain, the successor for MS Dhoni? This is the first thing that we don't know. The first thing is that you have actually stuck your neck out and said that Dhoni will not play the next year. I don't think so, Guru. Correct. Because he has never done his own thoughts and thoughts. So, no one doesn't know that he will play or not. The second thing is, go when people ask why. And they don't ask why not. Go when people ask why. And they don't ask why not. That's the time to go. You see the catch that he takes behind, flying like a bird. That tells me उसका घुटना बिल्कुल ठीक है. You see the way he batted yesterday. Reflexes इतने जबरदस्त हैं. He's picking up the ball earlier. और मैं सुनता हूँ कि बंबई में आके वो तीन-तीन घंटे एक नया गेम आया. तीन-तीन घंटे खेलता रहता है वो. Right? He's fit. 42 साल की उम्र में मैंने आज तक किसी को ऐसा fit नहीं देखा. और सबसे बड़ी बात मैं आपका जो उत्तर देना चाहता हूँ वो ये है कि in spite of the fact that he is not in the swing of things, when I say swing of things, Ricky Ponting was not playing Test cricket and One Day cricket and he was only playing IPL. जब आप आठ दस महीने क्रिकेट नहीं खेल रहे हो सीधा IPL आके खेलते हो, you fall flat. Matthew Hayden, fall flat. Gilchrist, great players, fall flat. But here is a MS Dhoni. Who comes at 42? At 42, like a bear from hibernation. <laughs> Have you seen a bear? Yeah. A bear will go into hibernation, sit there for almost six, seven months, right. come out, and see the seal. Ko Correct. Right? right? Now, that is something which is amazing. It has never happened in the history of the game. Ke koi banda saat aad mahine ka rest leke aaye, shadiyan vadiyan attend karke aaye, aur phir dressing room se set ho ke aake dhaayan karke pehli gain chowa maar de. Bilkul pehli baar batting karo. Oh bhaiya, chamatkar hai toh namaskar hai. Correct. Aur jab chamatkar hai toh namaskar hai, dousri cheez ye hai, ke woh gupt prachar pragat nahi karta, unki gharwali, unki dharam patni ko nahi pata hota ke woh karega kya, toh bhaiya, aap toh sawal hi nahi pata hota ke aap ye bhoot jau, ke woh karenge kya. Toh mujhe nahi lagta ke nobody can tell, it's Tony himself. Right. He is good to play for another two seasons, right. but will he take that decision to go on a high? Right. I would true. love to see Mohinder Singh go, Dhoni go on a high. Yeah. When people are asking why, yaar, kyun yaar, dos saal khel sakta tha, and they are not saying why not. That's something that I do not want because there is so much respect that I have for Dhoni. He is my favourite. An iconic captain. Not just yours, everyone is guessing. An institution, right. right? An institution will inspire generation. Men in flesh and blood will come and go. But institutions like Dhoni, Kohli will stay forever, right? Wow. <coughs> My friends here from the media, I hope uh, all your uh, questions are getting these phenomenal answers Main from Siddhu. Can I talk to him once Guru, hope is the biggest tope. <laughs> it sees the invisible, conquers the impossible. लेकिन मैं आपको बता दूं मैं आपकी बड़ी रिस्पेक्ट करता हूं और सबसे बड़ी बात है मैं या भगवान से डरता हूं या मीडिया से डरता हूं बिकॉज़ यू आर द वंस हु कैन इन्फ्यूज लाइफ इन अ कॉप्स एंड वाइस वर्सा अ लाइव एंड अ किकिंग मैन कैन गो इनटू द ग्रेव इफ यू वांट देवर द पावर ऑफ द मीडिया हैज टू बी रिस्पेक्टेड वेल अभी अब खत्म नहीं हुआ है अभी रुको क्योंकि अब जब सिद्धू पाजी हमारे साथ हैं एंड ही इज़ द ओजी एंड इट कम्स टू कमेंट्री ऑन द आईपीएल दिस टाइम वी हैड अ डेब्यूटेंट एंड आई एम सेइंग द वर्ड डेब्यूटेंट बिकॉज़ प्रॉब्ली द फर्स्ट टाइम यू सीइंग हिम ऑन ब्रॉडकास्ट बट व्हेन यू सीन हिम ऑन द पिच ऑन द फील्ड ही वाज एन एब्सोल्यूट मेनेस फॉर द बैटर्स चाहे वो इंग्लैंड की पिचेस हों चाहे वो साउथ अफ्रीका की पिचेस हों ओवर 840 इंटरनेशनल विकेट्स ही इज Pretty tall, and he's made a very tall debut when it comes to the IPL. Right, so ladies and gentlemen, let's bring on that tall, menacing bowler and now brilliant broadcaster, Stuart Broad. Roddy, phenomenal to have you. Thanks for and having me. This is the best part. We've got a bowler and we've got a batter, and you both are pretty much killing it on the IPL broadcast on Star. But uh, you had your debut, and since we have these two gentlemen here and clearly there were a lot of big bucks that were paid. We also have some great innovations that happened during this year's broadcast of IPL on Star. Take a look. IPL winners, world champions or cricket legends ke saath sitaron se saji commentary team. Aur iske saath satrave season par 10 me se 8 kaptano ke dil ki baat. फिर टाटा आईपीएल के ओपनिंग डे पर घर बैठे दर्शक कैसे नहीं कहते आईपीएल ओनली ऑन स्टार नतीजा टूट गए व्यूअरशिप के सारे रिकॉर्ड्स जब टाटा आईपीएल 2024 के पहले मैच को देखने आए 16.8 करोड़ यूनिक व्यूअर्स और दर्ज हुआ 1276 करोड़ मिनटों का 
वॉच टाइम स्टार नहीं फार इनिशिएटिव में लखनऊ सुपर जाइंट्स के कप्तान के एल राहुल दो साल से हमने टॉप फोर में मेड इट इनटू द टॉप फोर सो होपफुली इस बार ब्रिंग द ट्रॉफी होम टू द फैंस ऑफ यूपी और कोलकाता नाइट राइडर्स के कप्तान श्रेयस अय्यर अपने फैंस से मिलने पहुंचे उनके बीच बहुत ही अच्छा लगा मतलब इट केम एज अ सरप्राइज टू मी एंड यू नो टू सी पीपल कमिंग इन नंबर्स एंड गिविंग दैट काइंड ऑफ अ सपोर्ट इट वाज जस्ट मेसमराइजिंग टू द आईज स्टार स्पोर्ट्स पर अगले हफ्ते एक्शन थोड़ा गर्माने वाला है क्योंकि राइवलरी वीक दे रहा है दस तक और फैंस को देखने को मिलेंगे सबसे बड़ी टी ट्वेंटी राइवलरी के मुकाबले इन सब के साथ और भी बहुत कुछ सिर्फ आईपीएल ऑन स्टार पर एंड थिंक ऑफ इट वी जस्ट टू वीक्स डाउन व्हेन इट कम्स टू द टाटा आईपीएल 2024 राइट सिद्धू पाजी हैज ऑलरेडी आंसर क्वाइट अ फ्यू क्वेश्चंस ब्रॉडी दिस इज योर फेवरेट पार्ट आंसरिंग द मीडिया सो आवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज कमिंग इन फ्रॉम मोना फ्रॉम पीटीआई भाषा मोना प्लीज गो अहेड एंड आस्क अ क्वेश्चन हाय स्टुअर्ट Uh, my question is about the fans' behavior towards uh, uh, Hardik Pandya. Uh, we know that uh, hero worshiping is common in cricket, but do you think that this is the new law for fandom in India? And secondly, what is your suggestion for Hardik to deal with such kind of situation? And how does it affect the atmosphere in the dressing room? Because at the end of the day, they might play together in the T20 World Cup. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I think it's been a really interesting uh, atmosphere towards Hardik, yeah. hasn't it? In the first couple of games with the with the crowds, but but ultimately they've been away from home. So I think when you when you play for a big franchise like Mumbai Indians, it's like when I played for England against Australia. You expect to go away from home and and get hostile crowds right. because we've seen in this IPL so far that the home teams have been dominating. I think right. that's a lot to do with with atmospheres. Uh, how do you cope with that as a player? I think. It's quite important you don't just look to ignore it and pretend it's not going to happen. You have to mentally sort of steel yourself for for that sort of atmosphere. I think where it might be quite hurting for Hardik is if the the Mumbai fans boo him. I think that would be a really interesting sort of play for him because he's so passionate about playing for Mumbai Indians and and feels like he has the support and backing of of the the Wankhede Stadium. So I think that's where he he might need to sort of steel his his mindset but ultimately In professional sport, if you're playing in a winning team, if you're winning games, that's exactly what he said. It, that's what you have to focus Nothing on. Nothing succeeds so if, like success. If, you, if your mind drags you across to wondering what the crowd are going to do or or um, how the atmosphere is going to be towards you as a player, ultimately you're not making the right tactical decisions. And I think if I'm brutally honest towards Hardik so far and the Mumbai Indians, I think they've made some tactically quite poor decisions. They're not using Bumrah in quite in the right ways. The best T20 bowler in the world. You have to strike with him. um even to the first ball of their IPL campaign Hardik bowling the first over I I think that was tactically probably the wrong choice I think you should you know when you have leaders like Jasprit Bumrah get him to set the tone get him to try and take a wicket with the first ball of the innings and and get the energy behind you like that and um even Hardik batting too low I think you know if he want to come in and lead the group get up at number 5 and and uh, go and score some runs you know so you know I think ultimately he he probably he needs to just make sure he starts he, he gets his tactical decisions correct uh, and starts winning games because ultimately sports fans we 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 fickle beasts aren't we i know <laughs> when i support my premier league football team if we're winning i'm happy if not we're losing forest. i'm not happy so i think the the best way in professional sport win your games make some really good sort of calm tactical decisions and that a unites your team yeah and it unites your fans yeah, sidupa is nodding and smiling which means that's agreement with what you're saying bro <laughs> no, i i agree i'll just add on right look you can't fight the crowd there's no way mm. you got to actually focus on the game there are moments when a bowler will incite you he will upset you yeah he will try to trigger anger in your brain so that there is clutter in the mind deliberately and sometimes yeah, i must that's say that's as well incite you, that's right <laughs> it's called it's called the verbal ding dong <laughs> the good old verbal, verbal ding dong huh? right. so once that happens and if you get enervated right and you try to you know power yourself out of trouble that's not going to happen Right. you got to keep calm right and the surest surest form of failure is aiming too low if i aim at the sun i might hit the stars sure. but if i aim at the top of the tree i'll never get off the ground 
So he's got to aim to win. Yeah. Winning is not important, but wanting to win is. Winning is not everything. Well, it's so. the only thing. Correct. And once you win and you get back to winning ways, I think nothing else matters. And my philosophy is, Mohtarma, I'll let you know. Dunya mein sabse bada rog mere bare mein kya kahenge log? Once you are not smitten by this disease, then what? See, the world is like a crooked tail of a dog. Nobody straightened it. You straighten yourself. The biggest room in this world is the room for improvement. And if you can keep on bettering yourself, I respect people who are better than what they were yesterday. Yeah. And that's evolution. Right. That's the evolution that you're looking for, for Hardik Pandey. As far as the crowd, I've already said it, it's hard for them to digest. That the pride of India, the Indian Premier League, a captain has been announced for the T20s. Rohit Sharma is the captain of the Indian team, right? And he's not captain of his franchise. Yeah. Now that is something which is which is hard to digest, bro. And for that, I think there can be there can be remedies, but at the moment the remedy is worse than the illness. So the remedy would have been what Dhoni did. The baton has been passed. Right. Taking him into confidence, right? At the moment, justifying a fault doubles it up, right? Like Dhoni, Dhoni has done it so honorably. Their franchise, franchise has done it so honorably. The same thing could have been done over here. With some of my names. But the dilemma, because the franchise announced uh, Hardik as captain in in uh, in November, and the Indian team captain was announced in uh, January and February once he had played Afghanistan. So you can't blame anyone. Right. You can't blame anyone. It's right. just wrong timing. Right, right, Mr. Ankit Shrestha from the. From PTI, if I'm not wrong, sir, fire uh, away. Yes. Um, hi, 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 bro. Uh, good afternoon. Um, still early days uh, to judge Mitchell Stark, um, but um, do you believe that he's going to uh, he's going to prove to be uh, the costliest yet least impactful uh, player in this year's IPL? And as a former fast bowler, what would you suggest him do differently on on Indian tracks to sort of not uh, leak runs? <coughs> yeah, interesting. Sorry. One second. One second. Paji, thoda sa na square on. Right. Is, okay. Because what, ha what is happening here? Yeah. Alright. Back Ari. Guys, can you just take uh, the single cam on Brody's? Brody, Mitchell Stark, ex most expensive, costliest. What do you feel? Yeah, it's an interesting question. I think anytime you're bought for, for a decent fee, you, you want to stamp your authority on the tournament and not just on the tournament, on your teammates, on your coaches, on the owners that have backed you. So when you when you bowl your first two games, what is it, eight, eight overs for a hundred, no wickets. Right. That isn't the sort of, obviously, the sort of start that you want. But ultimately, KKR are two wins out of two. So I think that's pretty crucial because because they're they're winning. If they were none from two, two defeats, and you've gone for a hundred off eight overs with no wickets, I think even bigger question marks come your way. But one thing, Mitchell Stark is a proven performer. Um, he, he's someone who is very good at death. He's very good with the new ball. Maybe he's lacking a little bit of rhythm. But I think tactically. When I'm watching him up close at the moment, he's trying to wobble the ball across the right-hander, which, yeah, to someone like Virat Kohli, you look to bring in the outside edge. What's Mitchell Stark's greatest strength? What have we watched for the last 12 years? He swings it at 145 k's back into the stumps. And you ask any right-hander, that ball at that pace, swinging back to the stumps, is one of the da most dangerous balls in world cricket, the hardest ball to, to play. So if I was the KKR bowling coach, I'd be saying, Mitch, you know, <coughs> forget the price tag. Forget everything. What is your greatest strength? Go and write me down your three greatest strengths and then stick to them. Stick to what you believe in. Um, and ultimately, the IPL is it, the hardest league in the world to bowl because you've got the best overseas batters, you've got incredible Indian players, you've got young stars that come out of nowhere and are suddenly whacking the ball to all parts. Generally quick boundaries, um, uh, quick outfields and small boundaries. So. It's a tough place to play. It's a tough place to bowl. But, you, but when you're bought as a star overseas player, you have to come and perform. That's your job. You, you, know, come good. Uh, yeah. you know, you've yeah. got to come and do it. He started off KKR's, you know, Eden Gardens, very tough place to bowl <laughs> with the white ball. Uh, and the Chinnaswamy yeah. ultimately is, is one of the best places to bowl. Two tough grounds well. for him Two to bowl. Right. So he has to find that positive that, OK, yeah, it's not been a great start, but actually two very difficult starts. You've got Klaassen, uh, you're playing against Sunrise in your first game, then you've got Kohli and the Chinnaswamy. K 
can I pick it up from here, but ultimately get back to what my exact strengths are? You know, I, yes, Mitch, that's a good ball where you wobble it across the right-handers, but start hitting those stumps. Start swinging that ball back and hitting off stump and, and uh, go back to the strengths that have made you, got you the price tag, I suppose. Uh, can I add on? Yes, sir. You said it absolutely bang on. Look, the cynic knows the price of everything and the value of nothing. It's the value addition that comes to the team. That's most important. You see how, how adamant was our mentor right. over there, Gautam Gambhi, Gautam. that I have to have this guy. Why? Because the balance would swing otherwise. If you do not have a wicket-taking bowler, you know, it's, it's always going to be difficult getting the balance. They have three quality spinners. What was lacking was a quality fast bowler who can take wickets. He's dead right. Now, as a batsman, when I look at Stark, what is his strength? He comes so close to the wicket. And then he uses the angle with the old ball. But when somebody's coming close to the wicket, for an opener, it's very difficult to leave the ball. And if you're swinging it away, it's easy because you can see the swing. But when you're coming close to the wicket and getting it in, it deviates very little. But every time it'll hit your pad, you'll be out LBW. Right. So that's true that he has to back his own strengths. It's just a matter of time. Just a matter of time. He's tried, he's tested, and he's a wicket-taking bowler. He's a match winner, a game changer. Therefore, I'm not too worried. You know, one or two games here and there. Tall mountains stand tall with their grandeur in spite of a storm here and there. It's just a matter of time. Like Pant, he'll come back to form. Right, Dia from uh, Indian Express, what do you have for us, ma'am? Hi, Dia from India today. Oh, in, uh, I'll, I'll just do this again. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> Can you just take this camera? India today. <laughs> my bad. Right, so our next question, Dia from India today. What do you have for us, ma'am? Hi. Hi, Stuart, sir. So, you know, after the baptism of fire, do you see Mumbai Indians backing the young Quena Mafaka? A forgettable debut, of course, but the conditions in Bangkere with pace and bounce on offer in the initial overs, uh, similar to what you know South Africa has to offer, something the conditions that he has been similar, uh, you know, familiar with. So, do you see Mumbai Indians backing this youngster as they have been known for this? Quena Mapaka. No, you don't see him. No, I don't. Not yet. Uh, I think he's a fine talent, and he's. Obviously got the left arm angle, uh, did really well in the Under-19 World Cup, uh, had a really tough debut and let, let, let's not be wrong, he wasn't the only bowler to disappear, it was a tough night, <laughs> you know, IPL record score 277, it's, it's a tough night for every bowler. Right. Um, but I think they, Luke Wood had a niggle, a left arm uh, swing bowler fr from England, uh, and he was unfit for that game. So it was only a niggle, I spoke to Luke Wood, it's, it's a one game miss, so I, I would expect him to come back in into the side. Um, when, you, when you're an under-19 cricketer, obviously I went through it myself playing for mm. England against Juve, you don't, you don't have the backlog of skills to mm. fall back on when a batter of that sort of quality, Experience. a batting unit of that yeah. quality, Sorry. put you under that sort of pressure. I think the best use is, yeah, maybe come in for the, for the odd game, but you're bowling in the nets, you're at training, every day bowling at Hardik Pandya, Rohit Sharma, learning new deliveries, learning new skills. So when you, when you get under that pressure in, a, in an IPL game or an international fixture, you've got a catalogue of deliveries you can fall back on when it's not going right. And I think the Sunrisers were very clever in how they attacked him. Travis Head just tried to hit every single ball of his for four or six, but knowing that as a 19-year-old kid, you don't have the, the catalogue of experience to change up deliveries and, right. and, and move around. So you keep bowling the same pace, you bowl short, you disappear, you bowl full, you disappear. So uh, do I see Mumbai Indians sticking with him for the long run as they're losing games? No, no. because generally if you're losing games, what do you want in your changing room? Experience, people that have been there, done it. Um, and they, they're the ones that can that win the pressure moments that can win you the game. So. Uh, I think it was obviously a, a very tough experience, but I'm a huge believer because I've been through it and done it. You learn the most from your toughest, toughest experiences. Right. He will gain so much 
from being on that baptism of fire because he will sit in his hotel room alone yeah. and go, I need to improve. I need to find deliveries in my game that are going to make me have a long career. And actually, I think it improves you much quicker. By the time he's 23, 24, I th he'll, be, he'll be at his ceiling. And sometimes if everything's easy for you early doors in your, in your career, you don't, the penny doesn't drop until you're 27, 28. But when you have tough experiences at 19, 20, you'll your peak at 24, 25. So it actually makes Harder. you a better cricketer quicker. Right, Aditya Maheshwari from uh, Hindustan Times. So what's your question? Yeah, good evening, uh, good afternoon everyone. So my question is for Broad. While everybody is talking about uh, RCB's bowling and bowling attack, do you think their batting has also underperformed thus far? Because there has been a lot of overseas options in the top five, which has not worked for them. Yeah, good question. And a really, I think it's a great talking point because uh, I think a lot of people have a lot, a lot of different views on, on RCB. I think the, it's such a glaring lack of a star above that badge, mm. isn't it, for the franchise and the players they've had. You know, they've had a history of f fantastic batters, De Villiers, Gale, obviously Coley's still there. How I look at it is, I don't think their batters are underperforming. I think Kohli looks in fantastic form, so you have to look at what your strength is. OK, Kohli's in this rhythm. He's focused. He wants to be in that T20 World Cup squad. He's going to score runs. I almost think the batting's good. You have Maxwell there, or, or Faf, to look after that. But I think you need to play two overseas bowlers. I think the bowling isn't a strength of theirs. I don't think the bowling is going to win them enough games. I think they need to bring in Reese Topley and Lockie Ferguson as a left arm swing bowler and a genuine fast bowler and say to Faf and Virat and Glenn Maxwell, you've got this, you, you know, you're, we're backing you to, to get our runs on the board. We need a bowling attack to go and win it. Yes, it's a brave decision to do, go and drop Cam Green after whoever made that decision to trade uh, for, for such a, a lot of money. Um, it's a brave decision to then leave him out the starting 11 because you're sort of going against what you believed at the start of the season. But I don't think their team's balanced. I don't think it looks right. And if they're getting 180, 190s, I don't see them defending them at the moment. So bring in two overseas bowlers, say, yeah, I'm happy with the batting. I think we've got that covered uh, and see where that gets you. But it's a brave call. All right, one final question on this week's Star Sports Press Room. My name is Ankit Banerjee. I'm from India.com and my question is for uh, Stuart Broad. So, uh, Broad, you know, for, season, for a few seasons back, uh, there was an Umran Malik who took the IPL by storm with his raw pace. But today, he's nowhere to be seen. Now, we have another pacer, you know, who's coming up the ranks and he's creating waves in the IPL. That is Mayan Kyadav. How impressed were you with the young pacer and what is your advice for this guy? He can make it really big in the future. You know, Brody? Great question. I love talking <laughs> fast bowling. Um, <laughs> it was one of the most spectacular debuts I think you'll see from a, from a young bowler to come in and change uh, the rhythm of the game like he did. It was uh, He has great attributes, a very calm, small stride patterned run up with a great flow. He looks a really fantastic athlete, balanced at the crease with a, with a brace front leg. And what impressed me the most, yes, the 156 Ks, but his line was incredible. I think when you bowl that sort of pace, if you get outside off stump, high quality players will cut you and just guide you past point and score very quickly off you. Um, what he did is, once Johnny Bairstow hit him one through point, he adjusted his line and went over middle, middle and leg. You saw then getting Bairstow out, trying to pull the ball straight up in the air and he was beating international quality players for pace. So he has all the attributes that you would look for in a young fast bowler. I think the key is we, as fans, don't get ahead of ourselves and start thinking that he's going to play every single IPL game and win, and win all these games for LSG. I think we need to pick the games that he should be playing in, pick the battles of um, a batting lineup who maybe struggles against pace, he plays. Uh, you know, not play every game because it's very tiring, the, the IPL season. But he looks like he's got the attributes to play every single format, first of all. You know, India go and play five test matches against Australia in Australia. Does he look like he's got the attributes to perform there? Of course, you know, my mate Steve Smith, I'm spending a lot of time with. I keep saying, you know, you're going to be facing this boy. You're going to be facing this boy in the winter. Um, but really exciting. He's obviously had some injury problems the last couple of seasons, but he's got a mentor there in Mornay Morkel to, to guide him throughout, throughout this IPL. Uh, and I think it's more just, of course, we're going to be excited. When we see raw 
pace. We, we love that. And he's got, he, he's got, it looks like he's got a good wrist position. I bet he can swing the red ball as well away from the bat. But let's not set our expectations too high. He's not going to go and get three for 20 every single game. He's going to have difficult yeah. moments, of course. But what's their next game? It's the Chinese Army against Virat Kohli. I'd love to see that battle and, and uh, love to see him have an impact. But hugely exciting. Let's calm our expectations. Let's let him just develop naturally and develop on a, on a nice upward curve. Uh, but I think we'll see, we'll see him making a, a, a debut for India in the next 18 months. Right, so there's one final question for you, Brody. It's not coming from our friends in the media. It's coming from me. Okay. <laughs> Have you managed to see the new steward Rod who speaks Hindi in the IPL? <laughs> I've learned a few words. Yeah? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you seen how AI has helped yeah, us make sure yeah, I, that Steve Smith and Stuart Rod are speaking Hindi through and through on the broadcast IPL and stuff? I can categorically say one thing. His favorite word is Chalo. Chalo! 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 chalo. chalo. What else? Chika Chika Thanda Thanda <laughs> Chalo Thanda is probably put it but our members of the media chalo. from print, digital and TV. Thank you so much for uh, joining us asking all your pertinent questions to Stuart Broad and Navjot Singh Sidhu and please it's a request to all of you to continue watching our IPL broadcast IPL on Star but that's all we've got on the Star Sports Press Room what has been an absolutely riveting conversation with our friends here and our incredible star cast here. We'll see you soon on Monday as always here on Star Sports Press Room. Until then, it's goodbye.